This poster is a character piece of Howard Langdon, a Louisiana senator that in Kaiserreich and the Divided States timeline ends up leading the reactionary forces fighting against the military dictatorship and the Red Revolution. Collectively, they are known as the Union States or the American Union State. This fictionalized character is based on the real-life uh, Louisiana Senator Huey Long, who rose to popularity with his staunch anti-communist stance and social conservative politics. Many in our timeline decried him as a demagogue or even an American dictator. The real Huey Long died in 1935, but in this timeline he survives and becomes a major player in the Second American Civil War. As the battle lines are drawn, many states rally behind the Kingfish as an alternative to MacArthur's military dictatorship. Here it goes. For those who are new, I am Vincent Nill, an artist with a passion for the art styles of the 20th century and propaganda painting. I am also the founder and director of Kaiserkat Cinema, a collective of artists, actors and musicians dedicated to bringing free alt history content to all platforms. Kaiserkat Cinema is a fully crowdfunded platform, mainly due to the contributions of our hundreds of patrons but also thanks to the sale of our original art on our webshop. For this webshop, I have been painting original propaganda posters for all major factions in the Kaiserreich universe. These posters also serve us in building a massive art library for a World of Kaiserreich art book that we hope to work on in the future. The American Union State poster was originally planned to feature a family in an older sketch series that I developed back in 2017 or 2018. Um, after some consideration, I knew that I did want to have a poster on the webshop that would feature our character Howard Langdon prominently, as I knew that he would be a major player in the upcoming Divided States animatic. For this, in the end, we held it up to a community vote. and. The Kingfish poster ended up winning by a very close shave. I think it was about 50 votes. So the Kingfish poster is the first propaganda poster for the American Union State to come to the webshop. However, I do believe we will do the Union State family at some point in the future. Stylistically, I knew that I wanted a poster that would take some of the bright blue and red contrasts from the American Union State flag with a strong focus on Langdon himself. The painting style is actually based on early Leninist propaganda mixed in with agate prop graphical depictions. This makes the background ver very stylized, while Langdon himself is painted in a traditional realist art style. He emerges from a crowd following him, guiding the way into the light for a brighter future of America. I gave him the straw hat that was typical of the original Huey Long as well as a dominating two-piece suit and an overcoat with several medallions and pins now signifying his new status as the supreme ruler of the Union States. In all, this poster is intended to give us a vision of Yui Lang if he did end up becoming the American dictator so feared by his contemporaries. As usual, the crowd behind him are actually Kazakat Cinema patrons who get cameo appearances in all our art and animations as part of their patron tier rewards. To, to contrast with the Combined Syndicates poster, I decided to give this crowd a more rural setting, so many of them have former and worker outfits. Some of them are also doctors and nurses. The emblem at the bottom is our updated logo for the Union Party, designed by our very own Pedro Marzba. It is the same as the label pin worn by Yui Long himself, in gold, red and blue, on his overcoats. So that was my breakdown of my Union State poster. I hope you guys enjoyed hearing a little more about how this artwork came to be and perhaps this video has convinced you to buy a print of the poster and own a small part of Kaiserreich history. If you are new to the channel I hope you will subscribe to us to continue following our original art and animation content. For now I will leave you there and remember guys every man a king but none shall wear the crown.